Hello, this time we are going to create an effect to destroy static mesh. First, install the existing static mesh, or the desired mesh at the desired location in the level. And go to the detail window in the mesh to make the size larger. If you want it to be distinguished from other meshes, change the material in the detail window as well. Next, click Select Mode in the window above to change to Fracture Mode and open the window. Then click on the mesh and click the new button of Generate to create a geometry collection that can set the way to destroy the mesh. After confirming that the geometry collection is applied to the mesh, click the Uniform and Fracture to preview the result of splitting the mesh. Set the minimum and maximum values of the number of fragments in Uniform Voronoi. Then click the Fracture button to split the mesh. Although the mesh is split, the pieces are still large. Press the Fracture button once more to break them into smaller pieces. After confirming that the mesh is split, set the Fracture Mode to Select Mode. The finely divided pieces are randomly colored. To get rid of this, turn off Show Bone Colors under General in the Detail window. Next, if you look at the Damage Threshold, the Damage Threshold is set large, so it may not break even if it is hit by a bullet, so reduce it a bit. Next, click on the BP Rifle placed in the level to open the Rifle Blueprint window. If you look at the event graph, you can see that it is shooting while spawning the BP First Person Projectile. Click the Magnifying Glass button of Class to find the Projectile BP and then open it. Currently, Projectile is using Impulse at location. Add a continuous force to the rigid body. Using its mass, change the Add Impulse at Location node to the Add Force at Location node. Next, change the collision presets of Sphere Mesh set in the projectile from No Collision to Block All, so that all objects collide. And if you look at the collision component, you can see the sphere area to set the collision range. Adjust the sphere collision area to the appropriate size. Find the geometry collection you created initially and click on it to open the window. And in collision, reduce the mass to make objects break easily under impact. Now press play and then shoot the mesh, you can see the mesh breaking. If you shoot bullets at the pieces, you can see them break up a bit more.